I'm here with attorney Eric Guster to talk a little bit about the investigation into this shooting at the Galleria, where sadly a 21-year-old man lost his life. Um, the investigation of the shooting, what stands out to you just immediately about just crime scene uh, evidence? One of the things that stand, stood out immediately was they opened the Galleria within six hours. The entire Galleria Mall was a crime scene because from, from what we understand, there was another gun that was found the next day. So you have 2.5 million square feet of mall space where people were running and uh, obviously a gunman got away and there are thousands of cameras that need to review. They needed to sweep the area to look for pistols, which there was one that was found the next day. So it really brings into question, was the crime scene tainted, which it obviously was, because it was only opened six hours later. And so I know in your background, you have some criminal defense work in your background. And so when you're, you're looking at something like this, um, the fact that people were back in there shopping with six, within six hours and not just regular shopping at the Galleria. This is like tons of people mm -hmm. because of the holiday shopping. Yeah, because if someone shot someone in their living room, they would have that blocked off for a day and a half. That's a living room, a 1,500 square foot house. We're talking about 2.5 million square feet of space and thousands of cameras. So the Hoover Police Department and the other agencies who responded, they could not have done a thorough investigation of the shooting. It's impossible that they did because they were open within six hours. I mean, you have a body that was laying in the hallway where shells need to be collected, they need to take measurements, and they need to look for evidence and view tapes that they obviously could not have done in six hours. 